Hey guys, welcome back to the Warhammer Tacticus. So in this video we're going to play Praise the Machine God um, Beta Sector. Um, before we get started, I want to play once the battle number 7 because I was uh, advised to check the Pestilian build. So let's pick Pestilian since he increased the damage to the blast. Um, we will take definitely uh, Incheus and maybe we'll take uh, Calandis or Varro Tigurius. Yes, let's take Varro Tigurius. Mm, why not? Okay. But before we move on, um, a little update. So now the, the, the struggle begins. Taken down two teams. So it seems like it works. Okay, two teams of cramps is fine. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight teams, not so cool. Okay, I'm not sure why it doesn't work right now. Okay, now it worked. Five teams, okay. Two, okay, six teams is uh, carryable. Okay, one team multiplied. Okay. I think we got this. <clears throat> we got rid of... Uh, Okay, I didn't say anything. Okay, let's see if we really got this or, or not. Um,
Okay. Let's see. Okay. Two, four, eight. Two, four, six, eight, ten teams. Okay. Okay, maybe we can make it. Let's see. Okay. So we can kill this unit, we can kill these units. Um, we can kill right now this one. Yeah, it worked. Although it's, it's stupid, it worked. So, yeah. Yeah, now we can multiply. I mean, it's still stupid. It still, um, it of course helps a lot, but I'm not fan of this mission. Anyway, we can go forward. So, uh, like I mentioned, we today we will play beta sector since we have a lot of stuff to complete. So we will follow these four objectives and we will pull out another 2000 score, easily 2000 score. So this one, this one, this one and this one. We can take Eldrion, Shossil, Kalandis, Incius and Tyrant Guard, which will definitely die uh, very quickly. Mm. Maybe we can make something like this. So we'll play definitely around uh, around inches. Okay. So we can move a little bit forward. Sorry guys, I need to just... Uh, it's fucking crazy. People cannot fuck off for, for one hour. I will keep healing inches since he can revive my unit which will die so <clears throat> Okay, maybe we can go forward a little Okay, Inchus didn't heal the Tyrant Guard, that's fine.
Okay. Perfect. Mm, yes, yeah, so we can go straight to battle number five. I think with this team we can reach battle number seven or eight. Mm. Yes. Okay. of that uh, I think we can we can stay here mm -hmm. like this we have a good spot and the uh, enemies cannot multiply so it's uh, very good for us to stay like this can heal the Tyrant Guard and a little go in the front with Kalandis, she will not die and she will be healed and whenever she is getting attacked by melee she uh, make retaliate, 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 I cannot read this, uh, before she gets attacked so she has like double attack. So you can see how man, how much damage can uh, shuttle one one drone tank. It's too easy. Okay, let let me pick up the rewards uh, from the mission. Okay, we got this. We have three. Three rewards to claim. Okay, so damage, uh, damage by abilities, and this one is done. Yeah, we didn't open the crate yet. We should, we should capture the center of the map, or the left side, or the right side, actually. The right side will be better, since there are less wires. Or we can just stay here and wait for them. Yeah, probably we will do that. And Tyrant Guard can be the last one, since he will not be fighting in that case. Okay, make them flee. Perfect. Yeah, they they, they will be not able to, to cross this path, so 
Uh, yeah. Okay, we can risk. Why not? Until Eldron can tank damage, that's fine. I might misplay it because I should uh, attack in the first place. In the first place with Shossel. That was Emmy's play. Yeah. Okay, the drones are dying way faster than they was dying before. Putting here Eldron is not a wise play, I just made it because I know that it's uh, impossible for them to, to to beat me here. Okay, we can use Tyrant Guard, we can use... Um, uh, Tyrant Guard as a tank. So one, one map provides us 341 score, so um, it, I think it's enough. We have still a lot of uh, battles to play in beta sector and still a lot of in gamma, but I focused a little bit too much yesterday on this alpha sector with the mission number 7. I do not regret much, but if I only knew how it works, I would be a happier person. Uh, we can go straight to the right side. And of course, mainly with the characters which will provide me some attacks. So I go straight on the back. Mm -hmm. Let's stay like this. The Tyrant Guard will be small defense uh, from the Terminators on the back. So they will spawn in less quantities. Like, yeah, let's, let's uh, consider this guy as a backline. I know this is a weak backline, but let's keep them. Let's keep him. Okay. Yeah. And now we can use the the tyrant guard. He will die, but he is about to take damage, which which we want him to take. to use this ability and if you climb this it's fine that they are attacking Eldron since she or he has a um, lot of armor so we should make this play Yep. 
a little bit overwhelmed, but the map is helping us. And this will tank. So I thought that there are no more enemies. Okay. okay. They will prob probably take down the No? Okay. Okay, 363 score. Very nice. So we cleared battle number 7, probably will be able to complete battle number 8 and I'm not thinking that with these 4 requirements we can complete battle number 9, but let's see. Mm. <clears throat> so here we can, we should take uh, the left side, so they will come from higher ground. I don't know. Okay, let's try. Let's try to for force them to come from the wires. Yeah, so they will be stopped by this here. Let's heal. Ooh, it, it, it will be tough. And Kalandis is not one shooting enemies. Okay, so we lost Kalandis. So it's really bad. Okay. Uh, yeah, I think battle number eight is it's already it was good idea but not anymore. The twenty nine enemies. This wires save the day because the, this is like permanent kill of two, two players, two, two units. Okay, I think we can make it. The map is made to to make this this possible. Yeah, now they flee. Yeah, 
like the play was good. Definitely the play is good. Boom. Perfect. I don't know why for this stage we get less score. I don't know how it works. We get from the previous one 363 and this was 358. No idea how it works. Okay, so we have definitely from today uh, three chests, right? And we still four tokens. So um, let's try. Let's try completing the quest for today. Okay, so by what can we make by putting the most powerful units? Uh, okay. Trade with infiltrate, we can go for that. I mean, maybe if we... Let's see again, we make this trade. Yeah, maybe maybe without Rivas, but Tadius and Rivas cancel this already. And Morgenra cancel this. Alepnul. Yeah. Shossel. So maybe we can make infiltrate and no summons. Okay, let's go for that. Uh, I think it will be it will be fine. So, yes. Okay. Okay, perfect. We, we will play with drones. We want the drones to die. Take damage. Wow, Adrian will die. Or he will be close to dying. Um, I mean, we can do this, no problem. One, two, three. Yeah, we can go for that. This is how fun begins. So we will take these guys far in the back and we will use Yarik as a tank. Um, definitely we have to play more careful, so attacking the Black Legion in Legendary Event is pointless since all of your units will die to the Blood Letters. So they do not make extra summons like Necrons or like uh, Orcs or like, you know, other factions. But uh, definitely they make the highest DPS in the game. I took very powerful units here and just because of the incoming wave damage, it's just too many. Two hundred thirty-six is also enough. Okay, let's pick up the reward. Uh, so not this one. D 
damage and abilities, of course. So we can go straight forward and we can play the same units. Can we? Yeah, let's play the same ones. But this this time we will wait for them, so we are not playing, we are not rushing anything. It's just... Uh, So we want uh, three drones to die, so we can summon five units with Yarik and then clear them up with Creed ability. Okay, one minute died. Okay, we can summon with Yarik right now. Perfect. So, so this was the play we wanted to make. So now we can see the full potential. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six. I know that they will die, but because they are not so powerful. But the ones from the Yarig are on 48 or 47th level, so this is a lot. And now the Guardsman has increased damage. Okay, so this one wasn't that tough. We can play, I think, one more, then one more battle. Is it worth risking though? Okay, let's let's do not risk. Let's let, let's just make one objective then. So we can make Adrian, Fadius, Rivas. We can make objective for thirty score. This will be uh, more than we need, actually. We could play here with Alepno actually and Bellator. But is Bellator that powerful? Okay, instead of Bellator we can play Mogonra. Let's go for that. Okay, like make them make them come.
Mm. Let's take down this guy. Now this one. Now this one. Okay, let's go. Take four guardsmen on the back. It will help. <laughs> Evolve, not a challenge for for Mogunura. So the last tick token can be to complete battle number 12 in beta sector, so I'm glad we basically managed to finish today today's struggle. Uh, maybe uh, Bellator is weak, I'm not a fan of melee characters here, even because, because the blood letters can kill uh, Bellator within a moment. Okay, they multiplied, perfect. Reva's perfect ability usage right there. Um, oh. 
and we will wait for the rest now. Button. Mm. Okay, well, the rivers can tank to hits. This is 165 points from level number 12 and by reaching mm, almost 11,000 points I think we managed to finally get Vitruvius if I'm correct. Uh, no we won't be able, sorry guys. We will miss, uh, we'll be missing that few scores. Yeah, so we miss not much, but I'm not gonna wait two, and a half, two hours, 32 minutes to, to get this missing score. Uh, from the beta sector we have still a lot of points to pull out. You can see that this is from the 165, 155 out of the first eight levels, I would say. And later also some extra requirements. And still Gamma sector is barely touched. I mean, maybe not barely touched, but we... We didn't pull out many many points from the sector. So thanks for watching. Hope hope you enjoyed my content. Uh, leave subscribe comments. Uh, let me know if you unlocked already which reviews. Um, this is a brand new champion. I think he might be useful. I read some uh, uh, description of his abilities, and I think he will be one of he will be useful character probably for for incoming alliance alliance wars, since this ability looks looks. Pretty awful, minus 30% of armor. We'll see if it works against the guild right, guild bosses or not. So far, this kind of ability doesn't work for, doesn't affect guild guild uh, bosses, but maybe it will be changed in future. So thanks for watching. Have a wonderful evening, and see you next time. Bye.